this is your regular knee hook on the same side so I'm using my right leg hooking on the right side and you can go ahead and pose there I'm going into a straddle then going into a regular knee hook on the left side with my left leg on the left silk going back into a straddle and coming out this is your regular knee hook on the opposite side. I am going through the middle and I'm hooking my right knee on the left silk. I'm gonna go back into a straddle and come back down. Now I wanna do the other side, so I'm gonna go ahead and knee hook my left knee on the right silk. You can pose, and then when you're ready to come back out, I straddle, come back down. This is your reverse knee hook on the same side. So you're going through the middle onto the outside on the same side silk, so you're right on your right. Then when you're ready, straddle, come back down and out. So now we're gonna do it on the other side. So you're gonna go ahead and straddle, but you're bringing it through the middle, hooking your left leg on the left silk and posing. When you're ready to come out, you go ahead and grab both silks, kinda go into a half straddle, come back out. This is your reverse knee hook on the opposite side. My hand, the right hand, is holding the silk furthest away, so you hook your right knee onto it and pose. You can climb up into your half seat belt and pose. And then I'm going to bring my shoulder through, come back into a horse, and you come out of it. Let's do the other side. So the hand that is holding the furthest away uh, silk from my body is my left, so I hook my left knee and I can pose. I climb up into my half seat belt and pose. When you're ready to come out, thread back through, going back into your horse. This is your knee climb into your half catchers. So the regular climb, knee hook, same side, then you just climb above, going into your half catchers and pose. When you're ready to come back out, I straddle back, I put my hand back through, come down, and then we're gonna do the other side. So go ahead and we're turning a little bit, straddle back, I'm hooking my left knee now, posing, climbing up, into the knee climb, going into the half catchers. When you're ready to come back out, I'm straddling back, putting my hand under, through, going back to my straddle and coming back out. This is your reverse knee hook climb. So I'm bringing my right leg through the middle, hooking on the right side, holding on the right silk, bringing my other leg through and coming down. So let's do it on the other side. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring my left leg through, hooking it on the left side, holding the left silk, bringing my right leg through, back to sitting and out. It's your opposite knee hook climb. So you're bringing your right through the middle to the left side, holding the right silk, bringing your other leg through, you can go into trash can or sitting. Now we're gonna do the other side. So you're gonna go ahead and bring your left leg through to the right side through the middle. You're gonna put your hand on the left silk, bring your right leg through to sitting and out. This is your double knee climb from backpack. You bring both legs through the middle and you can hook one side, whatever side you hook. Your shoulder goes on to the other side in the cuddle. You grab both silks, go into trash can, and then into sitting. This is your double knee climb from standing behind the silk. You're going to go ahead and go to ball, go to pike, one knee hook, the other knee hook, climb above, and stand out of it. Wait till it comes off, going into ball, going into pike, one knee, then the other, climbing above it, and then going into standing. You can go ahead and go stand on your silk now and then I'm going to do wind walker coming off. This is your half catcher's pullover and the silk that is on the opposite side of the leg that you're using your right silk should be closest to your body to do a half catcher's pullover. So you cross 
pull through onto your hips and come up and you should be able to take your hands off. When you're ready to go back through, grab the silks on both sides, come back through and you can open it back up, go into your horse and come out of it. That's your half catcher's pull over. This is your half seat belt pullover. So the same side as your leg is the same silk that should be closest to your body when you cross it over. Then you're coming through the middle, putting it right on your hips so you're able to let go of your hands and pose and hold it there. Then grab the silks, come back through. It's crossed, but you can open it up and go into your horse. That's your half seat belt pullover this time. Then you can go into a single leg trash can, double leg trash can, coming up into sitting and out. First knee climb to seat belt. You're standing in back of it, going through the middle, knee hooking outward. You're doing a beat to come up and pulling it through to seat belt. You come through the middle and you can pose right there in your seat belt. Grab it, going backwards all the way through to come out of it. I hold the left as the right leg comes through and comes through again. Hold the left as the right leg comes through again out. Your cross hip pull, reverse knee hook to seat belt. So your left leg is in there. Your left silk is closest to your body. Your right leg goes through the middle and hooks into the back and you can pose. Then you climb all the way up into seat belt, come through the middle and you can pose right there. I'm coming back out showing you that you can come back through the middle again just to show you what you're supposed to be doing in seat belt. Come through the middle, grab hook and going backwards to come out, holding the left silk, putting the right leg out, holding the left silk, letting the right leg go back out. This is your cross hip pull reverse knee hook with an arch to seat belt. So it's the left leg, the left silk is closest to your body when you cross it and then you're going out into an arch. Your right leg kind of hooked over but you're going out into an arch then you kind of come up through the middle it's just a little extra added arch as you're doing this go through the middle and you can pose grab your silks going backwards through holding your left silk let the right leg through holding the left silk let the right leg through again coming out to sitting 